gonna do today? We're gonna learn uh -huh. and play. Okay. Sing a song and pray. That's right. God really loves us. God really, really cares about you, me, our families. That's right. God's always right there. Woo! Let me fix my curls. You've tuned into Cali's world. That's right, boys and girls. Welcome to Cali's world. Hey, friends. I'm here today with my friend, Chip. Hello. Chip, we've known each other for, like, well... Forever. See? We've known each other for so long and know each other so well that Chip finishes my... Sentences? Yes! <laughs> wow! So I thought we should take this best besties quiz. Okay. Let's do it! First question. What is your bestie's favorite food? Easy, your favorite food, Chip, is acorns. Correct! Yum, yum, yum. And your favorite food, Callie, is cookies. That's right! Question two. What is your best bestie's favorite color? Your favorite color, Chip, is brown. Correct again. Brown is my favorite color because it's the color of all my favorite things like acorns, trees, and me. I'm brown. Your favorite color, Callie, is pink with blue polka dots. Whoa! You even remember the polka dots. Now that is knowing someone. Okay, okay, question three. What does your bestie want to do when they grow up? A cinch. Chip, you want to be a squirrel because that's what you are and you love it. Nope. Wait, what? I mean, I'm a squirrel and I do love it. But that isn't what I want to do when I grow up. Are you kidding me? But Chip, we best besties. How do I not know this about you? Well, if it makes you feel better, I don't know what you want to do either. What? Yeah, because it changes like every day. Airplane pilot, basketball player, lion tamer, chef, professional cookie taster. But, 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 if we were true besties, then you would know. Minute by minute and hour by hour. What Callie wants to be now. That's what knowing someone is all about, right? Right? Hmm, I wonder. I thought my buddy Chip knew me better than anyone else. And I knew him better than anyone. We knew each other really well. But I wonder, is there someone who knows us better? I need to keep wondering about this while we check out our Bible story. It's time for today's Bible story and it comes from John chapter 1. Jesus began inviting some new friends of his to follow him. For example, Jesus found Philip and said to him, follow me. Then Philip went to find his friend Nathaniel. Philip told Nathaniel that they had finally found the savior that they've been talking about for so many years. That was Jesus. Nathaniel wasn't sure. So Philip just said, come and see. Then the two of them went to meet up with Jesus. When Jesus saw Nathaniel, Jesus said that he knew Nathaniel was a very good guy. Nathaniel wondered how Jesus knew him. Jesus said that he saw Nathaniel sitting under a fig tree even before Philip went to get him. Nathaniel believed what Jesus said and was amazed. Right then he believed that Jesus was the savior. Jesus said that Nathaniel would see even greater things than this as they spent time together. Not only does Jesus know things about you, but Jesus knows who you are. Whenever you feel like nobody understands you or no one is paying attention to you, just remember this, I can trust Jesus knows me. Jesus knew Nathaniel before he even met him. That's crazy. See? Even if we don't know every single thing about each other, Jesus does. That does make me feel better. And just because we don't know each other as well as Jesus knows us, it doesn't mean we're not best besties. We for sure are besties because we, like the people in the story, help each other to know how well Jesus knows us. Wanna know what Chip wants to be? Do I ever? What is it? Oh, a stunt person who does crazy stunts for movies and stuff? Nope. Uh, 
Uh, a professional acorn gatherer? That would be nice, but nope. What is it? A doctor. Really? Really and truly. People go to doctors when they need help. Doctors get to know people by asking questions and caring a lot. Kind of like Jesus does. And then they help in whatever way they can. That's what I want to do. That is so great. Oh, oh, and because Jesus knows you so well, Jesus knows just how great a doctor he would be, Chip. And so do I. <laughs> and even if I change my mind every day about what Callie wants to be, Jesus knows it. Friends, I got a little scared when I found out there was something about Chip I didn't know and that there was something about me that he didn't know. I was scared for a moment because I thought maybe no one really knows me. Have you ever felt like no one knows you? If you ever do, you don't have to because just like Nathaniel found out in our Bible story, I can trust Jesus knows me. Thanks for learning and growing with me, friends.